Hey guys, this is Top Fin, and today we're going to do a belt installation on this Hoover Whole House Rewind. This will apply to a lot of vacuums, but to be sure, I will give you all the spec. I'm sorry about my, my AC is running. Uh, I just got back home and my dad put it at 74, even though I keep it at 70, so the room's a little hot. I mean, I do have the central one, but I'm just saying. So that's going to be blaring, I'm sorry. Um, so I will give you part... Um, Assume yours is this model. It's a very simple change. I don't think you need a video, but we'll give you one. Assume this is your uh, model number. UH71250. And assume, so you lay it on your back, detract the uh, foot, foot thing. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. You just put the, the press it. Make it look like that. I got this out of the trash, so I know what I'm doing. It's not that the belt doesn't work. It's just kind of worn. I tried to replace it with the Walmart belts. That's a no-no. In fact, I'm going to show you how to do it correctly. Follow this with a screwdriver. First off, just use a basic uh, Phillips. I don't know exact size, but... And you're just going to unscrew each of the six screws. So, one. Follow it in the pattern. It usually goes one here, two, two is this one, then uh, I already did three by accident, but you just, it doesn't really matter. When you screw them back on, it matters. Four, this is the perfect screwdriver for it. This is a Phillips screwdriver, then five is right here. And six is where to, um, right here. Very simple belt installation. And I'll give you all the specs you need to know that this is the correct belt. Um, the change. I don't know why people throw away vacuums because of belt problems. It's not worth it. This thing's only $100 though, so. Found uh, some crap on my floor now. It's going to be a good suck up. Take out your brush roll, clean it, lube the bearings, whatever you want to do. This isn't, uh, it's up to you. Take out the belt. To take off the belt, you're gonna um, loop it and turn off the spindle. Pull out. It's very simple. You see your sprouch? It's very worn. It's not that it doesn't work, it's just very worn. Now I'm gonna give you a. Let me see if I can still find. There's a fucking roach in it. Something was in it. Uh oh. Probably shouldn't have used this. I don't know, maybe that came from my AC. I hope my fucking house doesn't get bug infested because of a vacuum cleaner. Um, looks like the part number wore it off, but this is the one I need for this. This is the uh, number right there, 56228901. And uh, this is the Amazon stuff. It'll tell you right here. This is the exact belt you're gonna need for this machine. Don't get the Walmart ones, they don't work. It says it works, it's just a dumb, it uh, doesn't work. They had two stars for a reason. They'll come with two for seven bucks. Take one, put it to the side. Um, to install is the repeated process. You just uh, put on the motor shaft like this. All right, you see it's locked. Now you're gonna take your belt brush roll. Line, line up the end caps with the uh, groove. Put, put the belt on the spindle. Um, you're gonna have to put a little force into it to pull it. But uh, okay, this one's lined up, and that one's lined up. So the, both grooves are lined up. Make sure it's straight, and that the thing can function, and it spins freely and doesn't do that. All right, now put your cover on. Right here, snap it, and screw in from one to six. That means we'll in, in make sure there's even leverage or whatever it's called. Hopefully just the belt doesn't smoke. If it does smoke, I'm gonna get pretty pissed. But uh, the first one did smoke. This is the right part number. You know why it's the part number? right part number? Because I actually took the belt off and copied the part number and I put it in Amazon. I know my shit. 
pretty easy to change one of these. Once you get the hang of it, it'll take you like five minutes to change. I'll save this old belt, but it's kind of uh, worn to the bit. You can kind of see some uh, wearage. That's why I wanted to replace it. I was thinking maybe I'd clean a bit better. Because there's a bunch of... Probably those marks were when someone uh, ran over a rug, for example, and they let it, the rug suck it. It's going to burn the belt, and it just snaps. It smokes and burns. I know. So if that ever happened to you, don't worry. Don't throw your vacuum away. This is how you replace the belt. Belt, usually you'll know it's broken when the brush roll doesn't spin, it's smoking, etc. etc. So, this is the old belt, this is the new belt. It's kind of stretched out, you can see. Um, now, we're gonna plug this mofo in and do some cleaning. But the bug ran away! Dude, I killed it and it fucking ran away, man. I have those in my house sometimes. Fuck. Where'd it go? Is it under my bed? Oh, that's great. Bug on the loose, motherfucker. I don't know if it came from that machine, but... Uh, Alright, we're gonna try it out now. Hopefully it doesn't smoke. Hopefully it cleans good. This one is the, um... Model with this shit. So we're gonna try it out. Hopefully it cleans. It's on level one out of all of them. I keep it on for some reason. That may be too deep for it. I'll put it at a two. Alright. The switch it, you just push here. Make sure it spins. And let's go, it isn't smoking. So it looks like it was done correctly. the AC's on. Now one thing I want to note is I got this for free. The only reason it was thrown out is because it smelled so I took apart it and cleaned it. It still smells a little bit but it's bearable and it's per perfectly functional. With this dirt bin I can use this as a garage vacuum etc etc. But that's how you change a belt on a Hoover Wind Tunnel Whole House Rewind. Um, this is Brett. You get two belts in case another one snaps. This one will be going in the garbage. It's not rocket science. It's Hoover. You know, Hoover vacuums aren't really great vacuums. You should get a Royal, a Kirby, Sanitaire, Auric, Mula, Ricard, Simplicity, not Dyson, maybe Sharp, not Bissell, not Hoover, not Eureka, not Dirt Devil. None of those brands are really good, are any good. So, yeah. Works just fine. It doesn't really work any better, but I'm just assured that it won't, um, it'll probably clean a little bit better, I guess, but it's not gonna really that different, I guess. I was expecting it to clean a bit more, but whatever. Maybe the belt, it still work good. Anyway, if I can rush it, it's not like I go.